Okay, so I'm recording this video as I watch Caitlyn's video because these videos, man, I love them. I gotta say, they're amazing. I like this idea. Some of you had made several videos on this channel and basically everyone's posted at least one, so I just feel like I kind of need to post a video. Christine, several times I was sitting leaning up against my dresser as I watched your video and several times I threw my head back laughing and kind of hurt. This is what I repeatedly hit my head into during Christine's video. Wasn't a nice experience. I just have to say, I found a ton of Harry Potter books at a used bookstore, and I just bought, like, a crap load of them. And I have that book, too, Caitlin. I actually, I stopped reading it after the first chapter, I think, because that was, that was horrible. Just thank God for Harry History Man, because all these other published books about Harry Potter... What is wrong with these people? I mean, Steve Vandrock starting all this trouble with Joe. These people don't even seem like they've read the books. Just, I've read one, maybe... Book, good book about Joe, but it's ridiculous. I took my wristbands off before I even got to the train station to go home, and because they were ridiculously tight, apparently I got a little too excited putting them on and just like strangled my wrist. I had all these little cuts and slits down my wrist, they're on that tight, but they're gone now, so that's good, but yeah. So basically, I fail at that competition. I miss you guys so much. Post LeakyCon life is so much different than I thought it would be. I just kind of figured I would go to LeakyCon and have ton of fun and go home but that's not what turned out to happen that was ridiculous and just meeting so many people that are like me and that understand me and that just have so much fun it's crazy being home and going back to regular life because that's what we did I stayed up all night every night we went out and we partied as soon as we wake up Wizard Rock you'd run through the hallway seeing people that you know it was like being immersed into the computer and seeing all these people that I talked to every day just as I walked through Boston and I don't know how I am adjusting to regular life I guess. Just kind of weird. I was shocked at the amount of people that approached me. So many people were coming up that knew me from Facebook and YouTube and they were just adding on to our group and by the third day of LeakyCon we had this ginormous group of people that I just knew off of Facebook and YouTube and then other people were adding on and we got the hallway of awesome and then circle of win. Just like that. I'm just really happy that I met you guys and you guys were the ones that I spent this experience with and I'm having a great time talking to you all on Ubu and everywhere. It's fantastic. Those of you I'm seeing soon, I can now wait to see you, and I'm going to attack you with the biggest freaking hug you've ever experienced in your life. So when you see me, kind of just brace yourself. One of the worst things, though, is that I've become accustomed to just singing whatever Wizard Rock song pops into my head and having 50 other people start singing along, and that doesn't happen here. I get some lucks, man. Cool thing though is that I've worn something Harry Potter ever since LeakyCon and I'm going to try to keep up with this trend. I have my lightning bolt earrings on now, I've had Harry Potter shirts on it's up until today, and necklaces, I got my DA charm, and I'm going to keep it like that, I like it. Oh yeah, and I've shown you the Tyler head. I love everything about Circle of Wind because it's just a constant flow of awesomeness. There's so many of us that you log on Facebook, there's a new message. By the time you're done typing yours, you go onto YouTube and there's a new video up. So this is ridiculous. I'm going to do Caitlyn's thing, but I probably won't be the next person to post a video. Someone will have one up before me because we are so amazing like that. I've gotten held back a year. I've moved houses four times. I've broken my sister's same finger three times on different occasions. Those are kind of random and having a little trouble thinking of stuff here. I mean, I don't know what you want me to say, but go for it. Two truths and a lie. Oh yeah, and Alice, you're my new BFF because you're also 13, and that's freaking amazing. My favorite thing about Circle of Wind, though, is just how automatically comfortable we felt around each other, and we're all so close already, despite the great big sentimental moment and my camera cuts off. How close we all are already, despite the age difference and where we all live. We have boys and girls, and... It's pretty fantastic. All of my posters decided to have a party and fall off my walls while I was at LeakyCon. I don't know what's going on here. Harry Potter on a stick says he loves you too. I have to unpack soon and I really don't want to because that means it's over, over. Ow. I hit myself in the face. 